let me first of all introduce myself before the whole world that my name is Comrade Mohammed Ali Ringe. A renowned proletarian and a human rights activist that can be located within the local government area around the territorial boundary of the Federation of Nigeria, be a West Africa, affiliated to the African Union, and my country being a member of the United Nations Organization, UNO. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I want to see this very means to call upon the French President, Mr. Emmanuel Macron, the person I admire, I love. But now I hate him due to the following reasons. Uh, if he's not power drunk, he's supposed to realize that it's an abomination to abuse Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam by cartooning him or printing him in whatever move as during his time. There are no cameras. There are no cartoons. There are no newspapers. Emmanuel Macron was not there. Even Charles de Gaulle was not there. As such, there is need for Mr. Emmanuel Macron to remember that freedom of speech, freedom of expression, hoping to hold a view, is not an extent that they can be inciting disturbances by abusing Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. I knew French had been exploiting Islam and Muslims, either in Iran or in Iraq or in Lebanon or in Syria or anywhere or in Turkey or anywhere before. They have misappropriated and embattled the Arabs, wealth, resources, and so on and so forth, including even Saudi Arabia. There is need for Mr. Emmanuel Macron and all president and all educated elite all over the world to remember that is an incitement to abuse any religion in this world. It's an abomination to cause Jesus Christ, as we Muslims, we are one that Jesus Christ was among the prophets sent by Almighty God, including Prophet Moses, Abraham. Jacob, Solomon, John, and so on and so forth. We Muslims, we are forbidden to cause or to abuse any among the prophet mentioned in the Holy Quran, in Jila and the Torah. So there is need. If Christians are not interested in bringing turmoil, disturbances, arson, including sad world war, they're supposed to stopped, hence post, abusing Islam and Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. As we cannot even abuse, not even the holy prophets, we cannot abuse world-recognized religions like Buddha, like Taoism, like Sikhism, like Hinduism, like Zoroastrianism, like Satanism, like Ekaka, like Nkrumahism, like Sankaraism, and including Rastafarians. We don't abuse any religion because to abuse any religion, it means that it's a provocation toward the believers of such religious sect. So if this world is not interested in sad world war, they should preserve all world religions, as I mentioned earlier, Ekaka, Enkurmanism, Satanism, Sankaraism, Rastafarism, Kumpushiaism, Taoism, Sikhism, Hinduism, and all religions all over the world. We don't want to abuse them, and it's an abomination to abuse them, even though Buddha is a human being. Tao is a human being, Kumpushia is a human being, Nkurma is a human being, Sankara, Thomas Sankara is a human being, Haile Selassie is a human being. But we believers in Almighty God, the creator of heaven and as the very good, excellent teaching of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, as we believe in the whole prophet sent thereof before Muhammad, before Jesus, 
and before uh, David, and before Solomon, and before uh, Moses, and before Haruna, and before anybody, as such, we are not obliged to abuse these human being religions because it's a provocation to their believers. And all these believers, these religions, they have more than one billion believers. So for anybody to continue, either for, from cartoon or Charlie Abdo or anybody or any magazines, pilots and other Washington Post and so on, if they refuse to desist abusing Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, I pray not this world may be in turmoil, war, disturbances, and arson, break and damages all over the world. All over the world, because Islam spread all over the world. There are believers of Islam and Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. All over this world. So if they are not interested in peace, they will live in pieces. My name is Comrade Muhammad Ali Rinyu. Thank you, Mr. Rebecca. Good. Hi, Comrade. <clears throat> How? I'm a...